Ackworth Grave Robbing Back in 1824, when Ackworth was still part of Cheshire County, the old cemetery in that town was the scene of a late-night grave robbing. Despite its terrible nature, the crime of grave robbing was apparently not unusual at that time as a means of obtaining cadavers for the purpose of laboratory study and dissection. On October 31 of 1824, 43-year-old Bezalel Beckwith passed away and was buried in the Ackworth Cemetery. Thirteen days later, it was discovered that his body had been stolen from the grave. Suspicion was immediately placed upon medical students from Dartmouth who had gained a reputation as body snatchers. Shortly thereafter, however, James Wilson Jr. of Ackworth was arrested at Castleton, Vermont and charged with stealing the body for the purpose of dissection. Wilson was returned to Ackworth, where he was held for trial. Bail was set at $700, but the case never went to trial and the bail was forfeited. Wilson's arrest at Castleton would seem to indicate that Beckwith's body might have been stolen for a dissection at the Castleton Medical Academy, but local residents still felt that Dartmouth boys were involved in the crime. Beckwith's friends erected a stone over the grave with the following verse. This stone tells of the death of Bezalel Beckwith, not where his body lies. He died October 31, 1824, age 43. The thirteenth day after, his body was stolen from the grave. Now twice bereaved, the mourner cries, My friend is dead, his body gone. God's act is just, my heart replies, Forgive, O God, what man has done.